aloha and welcome Sometimes things everyone break to this for the very wonderful and joyful occasion in the lives of Stephen and Martinelli as they stand here today before God and family to share their marriage vows to create family and to make a dream come true Nelly, I love you so much. Today's a very special day. Long ago, you were just a dream and a prayer. Thank you for being what you are to me. With our future as bright as the promises of God, I will care for you, honor, and protect you. I lay down my life for you, my friend, and my love. Today, in front of our friends and family, I promise you that I will use your last name. <laughs> I know that this means a lot to you. <laughs> and I will be proud to be Marinelli Saulog Bikra. I will love you more and more each day. As the song goes, I love you more today than yesterday, but not as much as tomorrow. We've proven that we are a team and we've accomplished so many things together. We've conquered the pandemic and I know we can conquer everything. I promise that we will continue to build a life with love, trust, compassion, patience, and forgiveness. I thank you for loving the kids as your own. And we vow to respect and support you as the head of our family. I am very proud to be your wife. Till death do us part. I love you. Stephen, Marnelli, may God bless you and may the Lord keep you. Because you two have so willingly given yourselves to become one, it is with great pleasure and honor by the authority vested in me by the state of Hawaii to now pronounce you husband and wife. You may seal your vows with a kiss. Ladies and gentlemen, it is with great pleasure and honor to introduce to you for the very first time as husband and wife, the new Mr. and Mrs. Stephen B. Craft. and I'm one of my Nung Nung's nieces. I've known her for as long as I've lived, which is 12 long years. She's not only my aunt, but she's also my godmother. She loves me and my mother, my brother dearly. And she's always helped us from a young age. She's helped take care of us since we were babies, and she still does now. Although, She's in California and I'm in New York. I don't feel the distance between us because she's always just a phone call away. My Nang Nang is not only kind-hearted, but she's also generous. She's not only beautiful, but also incredibly smart. She's also the strongest person I know. She's also an even greater daughter to my Nana and Tatai and a great sister to my mom and Tita Mao, 
and the best mom for Michaela and Madison. And I know she's going to be a great wife to Uncle Steve. Nang Nang, you have been taking care of Michaela and Madison by yourself for a while. That I am happy that I am happy that you have Uncle Steve now to take care of you too. I would like to thank Uncle Steve for not only loving Nang Nang but also Michaela and Madison. I have seen the way you have treated them as your own, and that what. Our family is not is most thankful for Uncle Steve. Welcome to our family. I hope that you both love each other forever. With that part dress on, with that part dress on. So glad that we can finally celebrate this day with friends and family from not only California but from all around the world. There's people from New York, the Philippines, even Colorado. It's crazy how uh, how far some people would travel for an open bar. Stevie, I'm so happy that you have found happiness and love because you truly deserve it. Ever since I was born, Stevie has always been there for me. Whether it's coming to my basketball games, FaceTiming me to watch sports together, or holidays, and for those of you that know Stevie already know how special he is. All of us, but especially me, are so lucky to have you in our lives. I didn't know really what a best man was supposed to do when Stevie asked me. I knew that in my eyes for the last 14 years, my uncle Stevie has always been my best friend and I just wanted to stand by his side. Stevie, I thank you for always being a role model for me and I have you to show me how a man is supposed to love a woman, how a man is supposed to lead his family. Uh, I look up to you more than you realize, <laughs> so thank you. Marnelli, uh, you're amazing. I've, n I've, n I've known since I met you that if Steve was smart, he would keep you. <laughs> you're smart, genuine, and caring, and you have two of the funniest girls I've ever met. Most importantly, you make my uncle happy, and that's the best gift that you could ever give to me. So I just want to say thank you. I'm so happy to call you my aunt. I'm so sorry that you have to inherit the last name Beecraft. It's probably the worst mistake out of all of those, but hey. But really, we are so happy to have you and the girls be a part of our family. Now that I am here, I finally understand what a best man is, but I find it a little ironic that Steve asked me to be his best man because Steve is truly the best man that I know. Marnelli and Stevie, I wish you all the best in your life together, and I love you both. Is make you smile when darkness still ensues. I want to be alive. Every minute, every hour, every day